Hello on the Pokemon Fan 993 here, back with more Pokemon TCG openings. Now, normally I don't do this out of order on my channel. Like, I usually upload, like, one vit, like, Showdown, Arceus, and the other two. <laughs> the pack openings and then the fourth one. And then I usually unite. And then I, uh, repeat the process. Well, today is the 27th, and today, at least in the U.S., uh, the Pokemon TCG, the Astro Barrage, was released. The Astro Barrage is one of these, and um, I was supposed to get a promo with it, but apparently the GameStop that I went to, does, their promos got late. Now, um, for those who don't know what GameStop is, GameStop is a place where they sell video games, training cards, basically any, a lot of anime stuff, and that's where a lot of people go in the U.S., at least to my knowledge. I'm not sure where GameStop actually, if it's a global thing, maybe not everyone's heard of it. Yes, you're going to explain that. So today we got two single packs, and then we got the three... Uh, pack with the EV coin and the enlarged Charizard coin. So we're going to upload all of these, and I'm going to upload this today because today is the when they came out in the U.S. So uh, let's start with the with the three pack. Put those down there. <clears throat> now I do, I do not own because this is the third thing. I do not own any of these cards. All so these cards are going to pretty much look new to me, unless they're like on the the uh, cover of the uh, you know the packs. One, two, and three. Set that there. Grab this. They made the coins a lot bigger than they used to, so that's kind of cool. So the coin is now like the palm of my hand instead of the small ones like they used to do. So, there is the Charizard coin that came with it. You can see that one pretty clearly. Sorry my lighting kind of goes in and out. We're having like cloud out, clouds outside and uh, <laughs> I don't have my light on, so... So there is the promo, or the, the thing for the three-pack. I remind people, I don't weigh the codes on my channel as of yet. Put that down there. And there is, for once, the promo is not bent. So I could probably put this in a sleeve. That is a promo. We have the basic Eevee HP 60 Carless. Be prepared. Attach a basic energy card from your hand to this Pokemon. Bite 30. So we're actually going to put this in a sleeve because this one actually looks like it's in decent condition compared to the other ones that, if you watch my videos in the past, they're always bent. So you know it's always, always a fun time when you have to deal with that crap. We're going to put that in a sleeve. We're going to set that down with the other ones. And we're going to open up these three packs. So you're going to have to forgive me if I don't know what the hell I'm talking about because I this is supposed to be based on Arceus Legends. I haven't completed Arceus yet. So I know, we'll start with this one because I know what this one is. This one is, I have it in my, on my team. It's the Hesilian Decidui. So we're going to open this one up first. Good, it opened up the way I wanted it to. And open them. There we go. Put that there. They changed the way the codes look, but there's the code for that one. All right. Let's see what we got here. We start with the basic Nicket HP 60 Dark. Rear Kick, 10. Basic Togepi HP 50 Psychic Ability. Touch of Happiness. When you play this Pokemon from your hand to bench during your turn, you may heal 10 damage from your active Pokemon. Roll out, 10. Basic Chatta HP 70 Carless. Collect, draw a card. Jabber on, 30. Def during the next turn, the Defending Pokemon cannot retreat. Basic Magnemite, HP 60, uh, uh, Steel. Magnetic Catch, Sh shuffle up to three Steel Energy Crafts to come out into your deck. Rolling Attack, 30. Basic Teddy Ursa, HP 70, Carless. Gather food, flip a coin of heads, put an item for your discard pile into your hand. Dig Claws, 20. Ooh, that's a V card. That's a nice little start. That's a Starmie V card with Misty on it on a, in a pool. HP 190, Water. Swift, 50. This attack damage is affected by weakness or resistance or any effects on your opponent's active Pokemon. Energy Sparrow, 50 times. This attack does 50 damage for each energy attached to all of your opponent's Pokemon. So that's a good card to use if you at the beginning of the thing when your opponent has the most energy on, the, on all the Pokemon they possess. So that's a good, that's a good card. We have the Stage 2 Vespa Queen, HP 120, Grass, Honey Rush, 60 times. Reveal on any number of Sweet Honey cards from your hand. This card does 60 damage for each card revealed in this way. Pierce, 90. So I'm guessing Sweet Honey is now a, is an item card that you can get now. 
What's this? Huh. Just it says V-Star on it. I don't think I've ever seen that before. Well, either way. We have the Trainer Supporter Choi. Each player reveals their hand, reveals their hand, and they, and then you draw three cards. Stage two, Quilava, HP 90, Fire. Tackle 20, Flare 40. Trainer item, Hisuian Heavy Ball. We'll get all your face down, we'll get your face down prize cards. Reveal a baseball one you find there, put it in your hand, and put the Hisuian Heavy Ball at, in it as it's placed on prize card. If you don't ha have a base, reveal a base Pokemon, put the card in the, Put this card in the discard pile to shuffle your, your face down prize cards. Because that's interesting. So like I said, I don't think I've ever gotten the uh, little thing in between it. But yeah, we got the uh, got a V card array. That's a nice good start. I always thought that the three pack versus just the boosters always had better odds of getting good the better cards. So we're going to put that down there. I'm going to put the Starmie V in a sleeve. I believe that's alternative art too because you can feel like that uh, that gleam on it. I have to go shuffling sometimes because sometimes the cards could get pushed back on what I'm doing. And that is number TG13 out of TG30. So that actually might be a really good card. I'll look it up at, a bit later. So we're going to put you right... Hmm, where should I put you? Let's put you over here. Okay, next we have the another Astro Barrage that has the... I'm guessing that is the Hisuian version of Palkia. So now I know I know that probably Dialga's going to look different too, but that's not really a big spoiler. To me, a spoiler is like seeing like every single Pokemon in the game, or seeing like a like a minute video of them doing a bunch of stuff in the game. But just showing some small pictures really doesn't ruin much for you. I wonder if you get to choose. Like I wonder if the Diamond and Pearl Clan, like like for example, you chose to be part of the Pearl Clan. I wonder if you get Palkia and then vice versa for Dialga. That would make the most sense. I do not have good finger strength. There's the code. We start with the basic hair cross. HP 110, grass. Horn attack 40. Overhead throw 120. That does 20, 30 damage one in your, of your bench Pokemon. Don't apply weakness and resistance for bench Pokemon. Basic Mantine. HP 110, water. Born ashore. Put a basic po Pokemon from either player's discard pile onto that player's bench. Aqua Edge, 100. Oh, they have a Suian Quillfish. Basic Suian Quillfish. Doesn't look too different. HP 80 Dark. Spiny Rush, 10 times. Flip a coin to get Tails, so that does 10 damage for each heads. And this little symbol right here, it's clear that means you do not need an energy attached to it in order for it to use that attack. Basic Glam Meow, HP 60 Carless. Fake Out, 20. Flip a coin of heads, your opponent's edge one is now paralyzed. Basic Yanma, HP 60, Grass. Speed Dive, 20. Reverse health of the pack is the Hisuian Growlithe, HP 80, Fighting. Definitive post defensive posture. Flip a coin. Oh, I can't, I can't read that. Hang on. Flip a coin of heads during your opponent's next turn. Prevent all damage of this Pokemon done by attacks. Bite, 30. And once again, the symbol next to the first attack, the definitive posture, means you do not have an energy, need an energy attached to use that card. Oh my god. Hisuian Samurott V-Star. Holy crap. That's what the Hisuian thing looks like. I think that's a really good setup. It involves from Hisu the regular Hisuian Samurott. Certain Samurott V-Star, HP 270, Dark. Merciless Blade, 110 plus. Pokemon's, your, if your opponent's at the one has a damage counter, uh, that does 110 more damage for a total of 220. V-Star Power, Moon Cleave Star. During your turn, you may put four damage cards on one of your opponent's Pokemon. You can't miss more than one V-Star Power in a game. Holy crap, that is really good. Ooh, they have the energies looking different, too. There's the basic Dark Energy. Trainer Supporter com Commando. Choose a card in your hand, and discard the other cards. If you do, draw four cards. If you have no other cards in your hand, you cannot use this card. Okay, so you basically keep one, draw more four for a total of five. That's fine. Trainer Stadium Jubilee Village. Once during eighth player's turn, that Terror may shovel their hand in their deck and draw five cards. If they do, their turn ends. Okay. And then we have Stage 2 Dartrix. HP 90 Grass. Flap 30 Razor Wing 60. So we've already opened two packs and we got two really good cards. Let me grab another sleeve. So for the two packs and this multi pack that I did, I paid 22, about 22 to 23 US dollars. 
But I think this V Star just might have made up for it just by itself. I'm not 100% sure. But let's take I'll, let's have him look at the Hosui and V Star Samurai before I put it back in its pack. That's two really good cards. Let's see if we can keep this rhythm going. Where did I put that? Did it fall? No, it's right there. And then, of course, the best other one we got that was a Growlithe, which I'll put in front real quick. All right. Uh, I'm going to go through here. Put this back in here very carefully. All right, we got three more packs left. Another one with the Hisuian Palkia on it. It could be an origin form Palkia, too. I'm not really sure. I mean, it, it is ancient Sinnoh, so I guess you could consider it as maybe an, maybe an origin form. All right, now I'm going to spend the next 30 seconds trying to open this pet because the t cards are quite tight in there. I don't know if I can see it feel them moving, but this one's being even worse than the other ones were. So let me try like, taking on a few at a time instead. That should be fine. Okay, that goes on the bottom, I think. Now I should be able to open it. I should be able to get them out just slightly easier, I would think. Okay, there we go. Okay, so there is the code. We start with the basic swine of HP 60, water. Stampede 20. Icy wind 40. Your opponent's at the point is not with sleep. Got naked again. Basic petalil, HP 50, grass. Spin turn 10. First of all, one, one, one of your bench Pokemon. Basic Bergmite, HP 70, Water. Icicle, 40. Basic Cyndaquil, HP 60, Fire. Charge Energy. Search your deck for the two basic energy cards, reveal them, and put in your hand, then shuffle your deck. Live Coal, 10. We have Terry Ersig, but this time it's a reverse howl of it. Ooh. Basic Shaman, HP 70, Grass. Encouraging Gift. You can use this attack if you only if you go second. And only during your first turn. So deck for the three card to put them under your hand, then shuffle your deck. So that's really good if you start out with that. There's another there's another separator. Trainer item dark patch. Attach a basic energy card from your discard pile to one of your bench dark Pokemon. Stage two Magneton, HP ninety steel. Bounce back fifty. Your opponent switches their their active Pokemon with one of their bench Pokemon. And we end with the trainer stadium gape jaw bog. Whenever a player puts a basic energy card from their disc from their hand onto their bench, put two damage cards on that Pokemon. Okay, so we didn't get anything good that time, but with what I've gotten so far, I can't really be complaining at all, because those are really two good cards. All right, so we're taking a look at that Teddy Ursa I pulled before I put it back into its pack. And now we have to open up the two single packs. I can put them back in here. I did with the other two. So I don't know why they put them like this, but you can you have to take these off essentially to get into the get to the pack, which is not hard to do, but it still makes me wonder why they do that. All right, the first one has the origin form Palkia on it again. Is what I'm go I'm, that's what I'm going to start calling it from now on. Maybe it has a different name. Maybe it's called like Pal Palkia or some weird crap like that. Let's open this one up. You know, I could it's spelled the same as sounds, but it's pronounced different. I've seen that happen with a lot of uh, different, like, trading cards. There's the code. All right. We start again with the basic Mantine, which we've seen before. Basic Hesuian Voltorb. HP 50, Grass. Cheerful Charge. This, car this attack does not require energy. You can use the attack only if you go second, only during your first turn. So the two of your bench Pokemon, for each of those Pokemon, search your deck for a basic energy card attached to that Pokemon, then shuffle your deck. Ram, 10. Basic Hasillion Basculin, HP 50, Water. Gather the crew. Doesn't require any energy. Search your deck for up to two basic Pokemon and put them onto your bench, then shuffle your deck. Tackle, 10. Got Glammeow again. Basic Puchiana, HP 60, Dark. Gnaw, 10, Slight, Intrusion, 30. This one also does 10 damage to itself. Uh, reverse Howl, Trainer, Supporter, Gard Gardenia's Vigor. Draw two cards. If you have any cards, 
if you draw any cards in this way, touch the two basic energy cards from your hand to one of your bench Pokemon. That is good for a grass deck. Oh, we got Shaman again. Interesting. Something you don't normally see. There's a, the V-Star thing again. Stage 2, Yan Mega. HP 120, Grass. Razor Wing, 30. Wide Wing, 40 plus. If you have no cards in your hand, this... If you have more cards in your hand than your opponent, that does 80 more damage for a total of 120. And we end... Nope, we have the Gape Jaw Bog. And we have... End with another Magneton. Okay, so the best card we got out of that was the Reverse Hollow, the Gardena's Vigor Supporter card. Which is good for a grass deck. I hope I, I hope we get that in the TCG because I could use that. And then to look at that card for the back into its uh, pack. We're gonna end this with a bang. I mean, we got two good two uh, two out of five packs isn't bad. Let's see if we can make it three out of five. Open up the last one here. If I could get him, I can use that V Star card. But I'm hoping that I'm I'm planning on doing it at some point. Because I'm planning on going somewhere and entering a, P a Pokemon tournament. I just, like a TCG tournament. Because I'm good with online. It's got to make a deck here. And I've learned how to, I've learned to make better decks in the last coming years. So I think I can manage that. And this one has the Hisuian Typhlosion on it. Spoilers for those who don't know what it looks like. Because some people have not played uh, Legend of Arceus yet. I'm going to put that in the, oh. Okay, sorry. I don't know what happened there. I don't know if it was... It, my screen froze. So, I'm going to put that in the title. Spurs, if you've never seen the Hisuian Typhlosion, that's what it looks like. So, I'm going to put that in the um, in the description. That possible spoilers or something like that. Because, you know, I don't want people like... Uh, they can, like, fast forward in the video if they want to see... Um, they want to know what these Pokemon are. So, there's the, the code. We start with the basic Drift Loon, HP 60, Psychic, triple spin, 10 times. Flip three coins, that does 10 damage for each head, so anywhere from 0 to 30. Got Yanma again. Basic Sudowoodo, HP 110, Fighting, Ability, Vamoose. If this Pokemon has any damage cards on it, it has no retreat cost. Double Edge, 90. This Pokemon also does 30 damage to itself. Basic Combi, HP 50, Grass. Honey Courier. It's your deck for an item card. Reveal it and put it in your hand, then shuffle your deck. Bug Bite, 20. Basic Routes, HP 70. Or Psychic. Teleportation Burst, 10. So it's your Pokemon one of your bench Pokemon. Reverse Hollow, Basic Oshawa, HP 70. Water, Beat, 10. Ooh. Basic Regirock, HP 130. Fighting. Regigate. It's your deck for a basic Pokemon and put it onto your bench, then shuffle your deck. Giga Impact, 140. During your opponent's next tur turn, this Pokemon cannot attack. Basic Fighting Energy. Trainer Supporter, Silene. Hang on, I gotta wait for my camera to focus. Maybe I can read like this. Flip two coins. Put a number of cards up to... Put a number of cards up to a number of heads for your discard pile on the top of your deck in any order. Not bad. Stage 2, Perugly. HP 110... Carless, Body Slam, 30. Flip a coin of heads, your opponent's Ethelon is now paralyzed. Slashing Claw, 100. And we end with the basic Azelf, HP 70, Psychic. Mind Bend, 30. Your opponent's Ethelon is now confused. Okay, so the best card we got out of that one was the Reverse Hollow, the Oshawott. Show that off one more time. And now, I don't know if there's going to be any data for this yet, because it just came out today. There might be some data. But I'm going to look up just real quick how much these two cards that I put in sleeves are. So just bear with me for a few seconds here. Assuming that Google Chrome wants to open right now. Because sometimes it doesn't like to do that during my recordings. Okay, good. Astral Radiance. First one a little bit is a Star Me V. Star Me V. Are you serious? Beg pardon, you want to go through that again? Did that say what I think it said? Wow. This, some, according to the TCG player, that thing is $33.47. Market price is still $30. That pays for my whole, the entire thing I paid just for this. Get off my screen, antivirus. All right, let's look up the other one then. That's a good start. It's $33 right there. Let's have a look at this one. Let's see. How would I put this? 
hit Sillian Samurat V Star. Ooh. That one's actually worth is it less? Um hang on. Let me check something real quick. I just want to double check to make sure I'm not looking at this wrong. They can't tell. Is this it? I can't really tell because this one has like a different sheen to it. And that's it right there. Wow. According to this, this goes... Well, this is eBay. That really isn't very reliable. But it says... Uh, current bid is five fifty, but it says price U.S. seventy dollars. I do not know if these prices are going to hold up, but if those prices are true, that means I made if I paid twenty, I made fifty eight dollars. That is amazing. So with that, I'm going to end the video here. But that is amazing, you guys. Those are some really good pulls from the, from my first Astro Barrage packs. So that's going to do it for this video. Thank you everyone for watching. This is the Pokemon Fan 1993 signing off. I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.